Hey everybody, 3KO Games here. We have the costume summon back with us again in Empires and Puzzles with a couple of new heroes, or a couple of new Toon costumes anyway. So let's jump in and talk about them. The two heroes that are featured are Richard, who is a really strong hitter with all of that uh, Toon bonus stuff. And then brand new Toon costume for Kagan. Kagan, who is... Uh, an okay hero. He was one of my first uh, red five stars. Um, so I still, <laughs> I used him for a long time. I think I still have emblems on him. Um, have a soft spot for Kagan, especially in rush tournaments, still use him once in a while. Um, but this is a considerable boost. Uh, taking a look at the original costume is a hit target and nearby for 380% damage, and then you get some buffs. Uh, caster and nearby allies, plus 24% mana generation, plus 63% defense. Five turns each on that. Toon costume is now jumping up quite a bit in that damage character, uh, category. 530% damage to the target and nearby. Just to put that into comparison, the first costume, which turned him into a sniper, dealt 514% damage to just one. Now this tune is doing 530% damage to three. Um, the mana generation and defense take a considerable hit compared to the original card, plus 12% on mana generation, plus 51% on defense, um, and, but uh, the, this Toon Hero will deal extra damage against nature. And of course, we can talk about this stuff at least once. Uh, these Toons are all part of the classic uh, family, so whether you have a Toon Hero or just another classic hero, there's a bonus in attack, defense, and healing for bringing at least two of these on a team. Um, of course, the costume bonus is the, is the real prize, 40, 40, 65, and 5. It's just insane. Um, and this tune passive, which they, they're still not going to reduce. 75% extra chance to resist all status ailments, mana reductions, and buff dispels. Those are so frustrating. Sometimes it's... That one tune that's just left the only person in a in, in a in a war uh, defense that you're that you're fighting against, and you just you, you can't get their buffs dispelled, or you can't give them an ailment, and it's tough. All right, oops, let's go out and back in again. A couple of other tunes featured. They are four or three stars. Uh, Cyprian um, gets. Of a very tiny bit. For the four and the three stars, um, they don't really buff the buff the special much at all. They kind of tinker with the stats and kind of leave it at that. The five stars, they tinker with the stats, but there's a noticeable improvement somewhere. Um, a Cyprian, the original card was um, caster a nearby counterattack for 125% of the damage received. Five turns. That's the same here. The difference is that you, if you bring other dark characters here, it lasts two turns longer and is undispellable. So that's, I mean, that's a slight improvement. Yeah. Um, I'm still using Cyprian for Cyprian 2. Um, now, it would be great to still pull the Toon costume if nothing, if for no other reason than just like getting that extra bonus on the stats would be would be pretty awesome. Um, then we have, and I still have never known, I kind of misread this card for a long time and just called her Kelly, but it's clearly not Kelly. Kelile, Kelil, Kelile, whoever this is. Um, the original card was 320% damage to the target and 582 burn damage over six turns. This is really just tinkering. 325% damage to the target and a noticeable reduction in that burn damage, 258 burn damage over three turns, but deals extra damage against nature. 
Um, that's it for her costume. Then we've got a couple of three stars. And again, really just tinkering a little bit. Uh, 225% damage to the target for Greymane. I've never leveled up Greymane. Just feed every single copy away. Um, of course, that's going to be the tune that I pulled today, right? Of course. Um, he also, in the original card, heals the caster for 50% of damage dealt. So, we're getting a little bit of an increase in damage. 255%, so 30% increase. And a little hit in the healing of the caster. But also deals extra damage against fire. So there's Greymane. Finally, Beelith. Now, I think Beelith is actually just a straight-up improvement. Um, as far as, you know, tinkering with the stats, they don't always do a good job really buffing a three-star here. But this this costume really um, does better stuff here. So the original was 32% rec health recovery for all and dispels buffs for all. Uh, this is recovers 38% health for all. That's going to get you over the the breaking point for, you know, several different types of fiends so that you can heal them away. Um, then all allies get plus 34% defense for three turns for all nature characters. This becomes undispellable and lasts two turns longer and then dispels buffs from all enemies. So... Um, yeah, if you're using Belith in a three-star tournament, um, this tune special is pretty great. And that does it. Those are our new heroes. As you're scrolling through, it's like, wow, there are still so many other tunes that they've released. Um, there's just tons of them. Um, I've got enough for four coin pulls. And then I might just do a 10 pull. I'm sitting on some gems right now. Um, let's see what happens. I'll, I'm going to go in and do my superstitions. There's a two star. <laughs> There's a one star. Well, I don't I don't have any more daily pull coins to, to play with. So I've just got to leave it at that. And let's see. Azar. Oop, Azar Tune. Don't think I got that one before. Uh, Azar, another hero I've never leveled up. Just keep feeding him away. Ganju. I do have the Ganju tune. Another, yet another three star I've never leveled up. One of these days. Ciao. Okay. Ishtak. Well, that's not boating well so far let's see what we can do here yeah let's just do one ten pull carver not what i'm looking for ganju not what i'm looking for yeah i get it you get the two guys bane not what i'm looking for Ganju again. Are we stuck? Please, no more Ganjus. Another Azar, okay. Balthazar. Do we have any four stars at least? No, this is this is what the poles are. Wow. <laughs> There's the gray main too. I I told you that's the one I'm getting. Dawa, Kalani. Is that ten? That might be ten already. Bonus draw. Well, hey, there's that. I haven't pulled the hero of the month yet, and now there, there they are. There's Zarga. Um, yeah, so no big luck for me uh, today. I mean, the hero of the month is a is actually a pretty good hero of the month. Um, I reviewed it in the April calendar video, if you're curious about that. Um, but no extra crazy good tunes. Uh, have to wait to maybe, maybe next time. But thank you for tuning into the video as always. And I hope to see you again real soon. Oh, 
Well, I might as well do that. Head <laughs> the Damascus blade. Excellent. I'll see you later.